I got it, I got it. <laughs> Playing Mario Kart? I got her. The oldest trick in the book. This is garbage, you can take your banana. That's <laughs> gross, I don't. Welcome back, Sun Chasers! It's a gorgeous sunny day outside. Today's another bus build. Let me show you why. Or let me show you why I'm building? I don't know, because I woke up and I felt like doing it. We got all this wood here because it's another bus day. Build, build, uh, ba, ba, da. And let me show you why. So this wall behind me has literally never been finished and we haven't done anything with it. It's not even painted, it's primed. But it's atrocious and I didn't really want to paint it. I wanted to give it something more. So we're going to do a half wall and today's the day. So the idea is kind of beachy, boho vibes. I've kind of tried to keep that pretty fluent throughout the kitchen. So our idea here is is to take the wooden slats and to go vertical with them halfway up and then just do one line across to kind of cap it off. It's also like 90 degrees outside, which is why it's kind of a little gloomy in here. I covered the skylight. Don't come at me. It was my dish towel. I don't have a cover for it yet. And I also don't have my curtains yet, which I need to get on that. But um, yeah, it's like 90 out. So we're gonna go cut that wood and we're gonna get this wall done. And also as of yesterday, we learned a new sport. So stay tuned to see what that looks like. And yes, I straightened my hair if anyone wonders why I look different. But for now, the kitchen. Time to cut these boards. It tends to get really hot in there, so we try to keep the door shut and do as much like outside activities to keep the AC running there. So As the door is open. Put the door. So right now, we are marking all of these boards to 13 and a half feet. Nope. 13 and a half inches. <laughs> 13 and a half feet would be pretty tall. Does that look like 13 and a half feet to you? No, I don't know why. I, I don't. Anything new in the Sun Chaser's life? Comment down below if there is. I wanted to go see Little Mermaid, but um, I don't know. I have mixed emotions about it. Has anyone else saw it? Saw it? Seen it? Is it good? Let me know. Under the sea. I don't know. Something about the live action mermaid just doesn't, like, think about having a real Think about seeing like a real mermaid. I think of like the mermaids in like Pirates of the Caribbean. Like sharp teeth, kind of seductive. But yeah, anyway, I'm almost done with these boards, so time to cut them. 11 more to go. <laughs> also, can we just like talk about, does anything out here like behind me scream allergies? Batter up. <laughs> Toast. Plot twist, we actually got them all cut. We were gonna go vertical, so this was the idea. This is kind of what it would look like. And as we were putting them up, I realized that I kind of wanted them this way. So it's actually, three up high, but kind of staggered. So like a subway tile, but still giving us that wood look. And uh, this is kind of the rough idea. We still got to fill in some blanks, but um, I'm kind of liking that a lot better. So we're going to run with this and see how it works. Time for the big reveal. I am so excited. This turned out freaking amazing. Let me show you. We didn't actually film any of us doing it, but this is it finished. I'm in love with it. I think that it tied together like the wood accents in here so well. We painted the wall really smooth. We still have to brush on some water seal, um, but other than that, it's finished. And then we just gotta paint this big bad boy and we're good. How do you think it turned out? But now, have any of you guys played pickleball? Wow, that's a tiny court. This can be fun. The thing is, I've never played pickleball, but I've TikToked and YouTube a little bit, so like I kind of know what I'm doing. These yellow lines is all we got. And if you play doubles, this is my only square. And don't you dare enter my kitchen. So there's a sport that's rising in popularity, sweeping the nation. Now, I've actually never played it before because I'm not a 70 year old man. I feel like it's about time because I've been seeing this thing everywhere. We got the pickleball set from Joanna Gaines. Good old Chip and Joanna Gaines. I think it's pretty simple. Ping pong, tennis, how hard can it be? This that I'm standing in right now is referred to as the kitchen. You can now stand in the kitchen while hitting the ball, I think. I'm kind of comfortable on this side. Yeah, I'm gonna do this side. The wind's blowing this way, so my hair is, huh? What side of the paddle? Oh, is that what you meant? Oh, you got the first point. I'm gonna try to play and video at the same time. <laughs> this is not working. This guy thinks he's good. He's not. I didn't think it was gonna be this humid, but I do need water. Let's go, round two. I parked almost in the flower bed. They just put brand new mulch down too, and Andy was like, sure, let me park right on top.
Oh, come on. After the serve, you gotta let it bounce on your side, and then once you hit it, I gotta let it bounce on my side. So two bounces before you can volley. So I know the rules better than you do. I lost the ball. I did my nails. All right, so we're down to game point. Score is 8-10. But it just started raining, so we're gonna play the last point quick. Let's go, last point, 8-10, win by two. Game point, again. Bad day to wear all white. Woo! That was so bad, I... That was a bad way to lose, I'm embarrassed. We can go spit around on the merry-go-round until we puke. Oh. Yeah, not a great idea, that was... You... I am soaked. We're out of here. Try not to run over the flower pot down there. Welcome back, y'all. You guys already know what time it is. It's coffee time with time. I found a burrito behind this plant. <laughs> and it's a oat milk ice latte, orange creamsicle. I have no clue. Time for a taste test. Here we go. I'm not getting much orange creamsicle in this. I'm getting like vanilla. I'm really not tasting like orange. Pumpkin spice to it. You got that going on with this? I'm gonna give this, I'm gonna give this a 10. 10? It's pretty high. Yeah, go ahead. Why can't I go 10? You're gonna throw that willy nilly out I'm like a 10 like that? It. No, it's, it's very good. And you started off saying, wow, ten. this tastes nothing like the flavor it's supposed to, but somehow it's a 10. You Here, know? Let me try it. Let me, let me give it this. It's very good. That's, That's pretty good, actually. It's good. It doesn't taste anything like cream sauce. Like, if this tastes like a popsicle, it'd be disgusting. Please attacking me. I'm, I'm starving over here. I'm All right, let's sandwich. get it. So I don't know if this was said yet, but this is Little Peck's in Troy, New York. I got a, um, a breakfast biscuit, I think it was what it was called. It got um, fry sauce, some sort of a pickled zucchini on it, I think it had. We're gonna pop this thing open, see what it looks like. Hey, would you, I'm trying to film here. Would you, would you? This is tiny, look at this. So we got bacon, egg, we got pickled zucchini. What, 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 what is fry sauce? I don't know what fry sauce is. It's just it's fry sauce. Right, All right, so apparently we're gonna pretend this is a fry and eat it now. What kind of bread is this? It was just a, it just said biscuit on there. I'm not a huge fan of like the biscuit. It's very dry tasting. The rest of the sandwich is really good. Pickled zucchini here, let me get up. I'm gonna give this uh, 8.6 on the Little Pecs biscuit sandwich. Well folks, thanks for watching. Little Pecs, thanks for having us. Join back for another video to watch another Coffee Time of Time. Peace out. Here we go. <laughs> they kinda hurt. That literally might be the cutest dog ever.